All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to some uh, Harry Potter Chamber of Secrets. I'm supposed to be visiting Professor Snape for a potions class. I think it's potions. But I do want to look around a little bit more. We have to go down in the dungeons for him. Some right there. Yeah, it sure is. We never got this bean. I forgot about that. All right, so we've been here. We haven't been up there yet, but we can't get up there just yet. Can we get these? No, can't. Continue looking around. Would you be interested in? What do you have? I have a silver wizard card, guaranteed not to tarnish. How can you guarantee that? You have no idea what I'm going to use it for. You have absolutely no idea. Damn it! I have a silver wizard card, guaranteed not to tarnish. No. I sure do. I mean, not do that in the future. Hi. I'm sorry. I just sold my very last item a moment ago. Why are you flipping around a bean then? Okay. Do you have to be so weird about it? All right. So I think I, this is the entire. Oh. Don't think I don't see that. No, oh, I can't go up there. Damn. It's time will come, and I don't think I can go that way just yet. Alright, so that's all of the interior. Sorry to hear about that. I'm very sorry to hear about that. Well, now we gotta go down. I think it's down, Oh, Is it to the left or to the right? The dungeons are that way, I, I think. So we'll go this way first and see what's down here. That's like the dining hall, I guess. Okay, we'll go the right way. Gotta explore, you know, you gotta know your environment. Get a feel for it. What? What? What's that lead to? Well, okay. Fine. Oh, this. Hold on, is this one of the... Oh, never mind. There's like a... There's a couple collectible things that you can find, and I thought maybe that was one of them. That leads to some place with beans. I can't wait to go there. That's a spider. That is a big spider. Fuck that spider. Let me stomp on that. Screw that spider. Can't go in any of these places. Alright, to class. To class we will go. Now pay attention. Today you will attempt to learn the art of mixing one of the most useful potions ever concocted. The Wigan Weld. Oh this! Potter, you have just volunteered to show the rest of the class how this is done. Get up here immediately. Okay. A Wigan Weld potion will restore some of your lost stamina. Even a single bottle is capable of healing the most grievous wounds. In this chest are the two ingredients of Wigan Weld potion. Flubberworm mucus and Wigan tree bark. Take them out. By the way, I figured out that stamina and health are the same thing in this game. So when they say a potion will increase stamina, it's really saying it will increase health. Now walk up to the cauldron. Okay. To observe Mr. Potter adding the ingredients to the cauldron and mixing them. Careful, Potter. You don't want to lose house points. Mr. Potter now has a Wigan Weld potion. To drink the potion, press space bar. Um. Seat, Potter. I think I actually rebinded that. Or, more probably, clumsy, will no doubt want to make Wigan World potions on your own. Therefore, there are cauldrons like this one throughout Hogwarts. They are the only cauldrons in which Wigan World potions can be made. And the ingredients, flubberworm mucus and Wigan tree bark, can also be found throughout Hogwarts. Now, in like really obscure places. The history of flubberworm mucus extraction. There was a chest back there, and I, I wanted saw that it. Lecture. I thought I knew everything I wanted to about flubberworm mucus, and I was right. <laughs> well, I thought he touched on some interesting aspects. 
Let's get going before Snake comes out. I don't want to be ripped. It was coming from over there. Come on. I'd really rather not be ripped, if at all possible. Like if I had the choice, I'd just choose not to be ripped. Uh, he's like really able to identify where this thing came from, like really, really precisely. The poor cat. That is my favorite character in the game thus far. That's horrible. What's going on? Enemies of the air, beware. You'll be next, mudbloods. She's been petrified, but how? I cannot say. And now, I would like everybody to please return to their dormitories. There's nothing else to see here. Come on, Harry. Professor Dumbledore's right. There's nothing more to see here. I don't know, I thought it was pretty interesting, actually, Ron, okay? Don't tell me what to do. Everyone at Hogwarts was disturbed by the attack on Mrs. Norris and the mysterious words scrawled on a wall. Rumors and speculation spread. Hermione in particular was especially affected. Ron and Harry became sure that she was up to something, but whatever it was, she remained tight-lipped. No. We have to get to Charms class, Harry, and I have an idea. An idea about what? We should ask Professor Flitwick about the Chamber of Secrets. He's bound to know something. Let's go. Uh huh. yeah, because that's a really clever idea. Ask a teacher with the. Going, Will you? <sighs> These people. I swear. I swear. What kind of a picture of like what kind of modern art is this? That probably sold for like thousands of dollars, and it upsets me. This, on the other hand, this is a masterpiece right right here. I mean, all right, let's move on. I find it very amusing. Hurry up, Harry. We don't want to be late for charms. Coming, Hermione. I forgot how much more to the map there is to explore. Let's see what's down here. Oh, this is the ground floor. We can save. The second year student. I don't have time to talk to second year. I'm about to fucking kick your ass, my friend. Oh, sorry, I just sold my very last item a moment Stop ago. Stop flipping around a bean, then. What do you have? I have a silver wizard card. Never even shuffled before. Nope. Passing up a bargain, but have it your way. I'm not gonna buy wizard cards. I'd rather have things that are what do you have? have more useful I things. mucus for a limited time only. Flubberworm mucus. That's actually not bad. But these are becoming hard to find. Uh, I won't. Really? I okay, I didn't even get to move. All right, sure. As you wish, but these are becoming hard to find. Bitch, I fuck you up. Look, they love this picture of the blonde guy so much. They have three of them in one spot. That's amazing. That's so great. All right, that was the third floor, right? Yeah, third floor. Let me get over there. All right, this is that room. Wait. This isn't a mirror? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought that was a mirror. Can I get that? No. Give me all the beans. Alright, nothing else in there. Yeah, I thought that was a mirror. That's probably their that's their whole trick. It's all part of their game. Be right with you. There's a whole other bean in here. Oh, we're going right by the thing. Nice. He's gonna talk some shit. You know he's gonna talk some shit. Guaranteed. 
or not. Hold on. There it is. See, I had to induce the shit talking, but it happened. Look at that. All right, we're almost to class. It was this way, right? Oh, the short guy, the dwarf. Into charms class. Today we shall be learning the scourge charm. Yes, Miss Granger. I was just wondering if you could uh, tell us something about the Chamber of Secrets. I deal with charms, Miss Granger, not myths and legends. Please, Professor, we all want to hear. Oh, very well. There were four founders of Hogwarts, Godric Gryffindor, Salazar Slytherin, Helga Hufflepuff, and Rowena Ravenclaw. Third names are really Slytherin fun. wanted to admit only the wizard-born students to Hogwarts. The other founders refused, and as a result, Slytherin left the school. Yes, Miss Granger? He built a secret chamber in the castle of which the other founders knew nothing. Why do you ask if you already knew? ...monster to guard the chamber from within. The legend states that one day, Slytherin's true heir will return to open the chamber and control the horror within. And then, all who are not wizard-born will be purged from Hogwarts. All nonsense, of course. Now, back to magic reality. Mr. Potter, perhaps you'd like to step forward and demonstrate Scourge for the class. Jesus. Actually, Professor. Everyone wants me to do all the things. It sucks being famous, let me tell you. All right, I'm... Try not to focus on all this Chamber of Secrets, Balderdash. Concentrate on the symbol in front of you. Okay. The wand is about to move its way around the symbol. I already know how to do it. At the exact point when the wand passes over the arrows, you'll need to hit the corresponding arrow key. This exercise has three levels. Oh my gosh. level, you must successfully hit all of the arrows in sequence. Ready to try? You already explained it. Go. He, he has, I'm not him specifically, but this has been explained to me already. It's, it's the exact same thing, just with a different symbol. Like that actually has any impact on the gameplay. There we go. I nailed it. Nailed that shit. Well done, Harry. You've advanced to the next level of the lesson. Five points to Gryffindor. Only five. Round two. Go. But the disappointment is strong here. Only five points. Should get at least ten. Like minimum. Minimum ten. This is a lot of hard work for me, pressing these buttons. I'll have you know. Well done, Harry. You've advanced to the next level of the lesson. Ten points to Gryffindor. Round three. Go. I almost missed that one. Concentrating super duper hard right now. Well, yeah. You've completed all of the necessary exercises. I sure did. Fifteen points to Gryffindor. There is a good fifteen right there. Well done, Mr. Potter. You've successfully learned Scourge. I don't know what it does now though. It's time for you to test your newly learned knowledge in the Scourge Spell Challenge. Okay. The Scourge Spell Challenge. Welcome, Harry Potter, to my Scourge Challenge. To complete the challenge, you must find the completion star, which can be found several floors below us. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, you lose the challenge. All right, I'm going to get this. Along the way, you'll find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. I highly recommend you try to find all of them. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Alright, we're gonna get this.